Hello, welcome to Angie's Craft Corn. Today we are going to do redo a corn that I've done a few weeks ago, and it's of this lighthouse and um, inking and anyways, we're gonna see if we can redo this. But we are you just wanted to show you the corn that we all I'm going to try to duplicate and move it out of my way. I'm using this stamp set and I got it off a of wish is all I can tell you because I'm not sure where I got it I mean other than that and uh, we are going to play around with some of the effects and see what we can come up with and knowing me it won't be exactly like this one because I just don't do that too much so anyways with that being said we're going to get busy I've already cut me a piece of cardstock, a half a sheet of a eight and a half by eleven in half, five and a half by eight and a half, and folded it ready to go. Uh, this is no gluing, any of that. I'm going to be using my Ranger or Arca or Arca ink pads. And as you can tell, I've got cotton balls ready to go. So I'm going to move this out of my way and uh, get ready. I'll need orange. Let me need the one I want. I am going to use um, Bright Tango. Um. Chrome yellow and cobalt blue and brown and coffee and black. I'll get it all here. Jet black. And all of those is the all call for inks. Um I'm trying So <sighs> with that being said, I'm gonna get my Block out, and I'm just using a Martha Stewart um, acrylic block today, and uh, gotta find my corn bow. And I'm gonna stamp the brown on um, before I stamp anything else on, and then build from that. And you can tell I've used these stamps before. I'm using the coffee. And I'm stamping this one right in the middle of my card base. And I'm stamping off. That's why I've got the white uh, piece of uh, tapping paper. I didn't do that too good. But anyways, that's life. <laughs> Now I'm taking the little one and doing the same thing. And I'm just going to put my ink pad over here. And just stamping it. And this is why they tell you stamp it. And I am getting over bronchitis, so bear with me, my snotty, sneezy self. Next to my son. Bringing it home to me. As usual. Let's put this one a little bit more. Okay, now we are going to take the cobalt blue and a cotton ball and I'm just going and then just go in, ink. And 
And yes, the dogs is out here with me today, so bear with them. And then we're going to use chrome yellow. And I'm going to do most of this with the chrome yellow. And then go back with the tango, bright tango. And like I said, this won't be the same because I just don't read. But it will be a general idea. Maybe. We hope. So, how's everybody's weekend going? Mine went pretty good. Was sick most of it, but hey, it's life. We've got Devin home this weekend, so, and he's been sick. Joey took him to the doctor. Man. Friday, and then turn around and had to take me. So he had Joey had a plenty of office visits Friday. Okay, we are going to use. I'm going to put the lighthouse on and use the jet black. And I'm going to soak this damp up pretty good, and then stick you. That way belongs. <sighs> and then I'm going to use the um, bright tango and do the light. And this is what's tricky. I don't think I think I used something different. Let's try this. I'm gonna use a macho grunt orange. I think that's probably what I used. And I'm gonna try to restamp this. Now I might get my head in the way, and I did. Yeah. I don't think I use this either, but and you can tell I didn't get this even. I meant to, but I did it. I used. Oh yeah, I need green too. Okay, 
now I'm going to do the uh, ducks. Now I'm just going to stamp the black right here. And now I'll do the boards. And I'm going to do about three to four sets of these. And then all the grass. And I'm going to use a uh, Le Porte Green for that. And I'm stamping off of my corn just enough to give it like I said this ain't gonna be exactly the same because I just had another idea so Now I'm taking the little small grass and just going in and filling in where I want it. Okay. Now I'm going to pick my saiyan and it says in high tide or low tide I'll, I'll be by your side. Um, this is the one we're going to use. And I'm going to use my jet black. Make sure I got it just so so. And then I'm just going to take the cobalt blue and ink just go around the edges real good. And though we have a card in less than 15 minutes with no glue and with started out as white card stock and uh, it's not exactly the same as you can see from side by side. Even the size is different. So, <clears throat> though we have it, I, I, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for joining us at Angie's Craft Corner. Stay tuned for more videos like this one. Give us a thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe to us if you haven't already. Hit the bell for notifications. And I will see you later. Love y'all. Have a blessed day. And catch you later. Bye. Mm -hmm.